Hi Kerry, um, I've got to the stage where our goldsmith has unset your stones for me so I can lay them out on a scale sketch. So for example, I can put your lovely sapphire there and you can see I've done what I call a rub over setting rather than claws but with that art deco style beading on it and then your round diamonds around the edge in also rub over settings but they're very small and with this sort of very art deco style sort of cutting I can ask the CAD designers to CAD up a design like this one with no more fancy bits <laughs> um, but I can also ask them to see if they can put some diamond cutting detail on these surfaces or bead them up and likewise down the edge there so if I just draw it while I'm filming I don't know if I can manage to do that get the camera in the right place hold it still so we can add beading along both these edges and stop it there or carry it on around the ring I mean to be honest you're not going to see it and it will probably wear off on the underside of your finger with time. Um, so can you see the difference from this side to this side? I've also had a play around with the stone sizes because they are, your round ones, there are some bigger ones and some smaller ones. So I've proposed that we put the bigger ones there and the smaller ones on the outside because we do want this ring to sit as nicely up against your engagement ring as possible and not create a gap so we're going to design the underside I haven't got to that bit yet but we're going to design the underside oh they look cool <laughs> um, to be slightly angled and undercut so that works really well but you can see it really coming together now completely bespoke design just for you based on what you've told me you like um, and the beautiful thing is we can still make tweaks and changes. But yeah, that's coming together really nicely. I hope you like it, but please do give me some feedback.